We've got the 2019 Gatorade Athlete of the Year Awards here in Rio de Janeiro, California with Allison Felix, one of our guest honorees here, basically a host. Back in 2003, the very first year that Track and Field for Girls was involved in this precious event, and you were the national winner. Here we are 16 years later, <laughs> enormously involved in the event. This has been obviously a big part of your life, your success in track and field. And you know, a big part of it early on was again, starting off with Gatorade. Uh, what, do you, what, do you, what are your memories from back then and how important, how precious is this for high schoolers? It's kind of level of award. I have great memories of this award, of you know, the whole time period. Um, it was just such a fun experience and um, such an honor, you know, such an important award. And I felt like it really gave me the confidence as I um, started my career. And so I'm excited to be back and to be able to, you know, see these kids in this moment and then go on and follow their career. Nowadays, it's just so phenomenal, the growth of this award and what it means to kids and just opening their eyes and memorable you know, few days, obviously. Uh, as far as your, your career, you've enjoyed so much success. You know, recently, you've been in the news and quite a bit you know, for, for reasons to deal with. Uh, basically, opportunity, uh, you know, how you want to talk about it in a sense. But uh, the sport has changed so much over the years. Not just track and field, but, but sports in general. Mm -hmm. The business of sports, much, much, much more so. And high school sports with social media and such. Uh, what are your thoughts on how much this, the society has changed governing sports? Yeah, I mean, I think a lot has has changed and we've evolved. I think hopefully we're going in the right the right direction. Um, I think it's an important time right now, um, a time for change um, to use our voices. You know, as my career has has gone on and you know I've seen the importance of that and different things that I've been through and to be able to speak up about those experiences it's not just about what happens on the track but it's life as well and um, and yeah so I just want to take advantage of those opportunities and hopefully help move things forward and now obviously your life, your life has changed dramatically with the Cameron you know your first child uh, and then moving on in a sense uh, looking at the potential of Olympics in 2020 and such when you have a child, obviously things change dramatically in terms of priorities. Yeah. How much has your life changed and how has that impacted trying to take care of you know, business and track and field? Yeah, life is a lot different now. Um, it's really exciting though. I, I love motherhood. I'm enjoying it. It's super challenging and especially balancing that with um, a career in athletics, but I'm so excited about it and I'm so looking forward to next year. I'm excited to be back and looking forward to competing and um, you know, it's a, it's a big goal. It's a big challenge, but um, I'm, I'm up for it and now I have, you know, the most amazing little girl to go out there and show that, you know, you can do anything in the face of a lot of obstacles, so I'm looking forward to it. So what you've succeeded in achieving over the years in this sport, obviously you have a grand following now. A lot of people look up to you, obviously. You're still quite young, in a sense. I mean, I mean really, in a sense. Uh, track and field competitive career will obviously eventually come to an end yeah. at some point in time. But at your youth, in a sense, really, what's, what's life going to be like for Allison possibly after the competitive part of track and field is over. What, what are you kind of looking forward to? Um, I, I hope to, you know, to continue to advocate for causes that are close to my heart, you know, continue to do some of that meaningful work um, that's away from the track. And so I'll always want to stay connected with the sport, um, but I'm looking forward to um, being involved with organizations um, and other opportunities that, um, you know, that are other passions. Can you give us an update where things are currently with track and field for you at this point in time? Yeah, I'm really looking forward to going to nationals. And so I'll be competing in the 400 meters there. And yeah, just excited. To be back. All right, Allison Felix again, 2003, our girls athlete of the year for track and field. The actually the overall, and then now coming back here, being one of the hosts here for the current generation of high school standouts. Good to see you again. Thank nice you. To see you.